Hello everyone, welcome to Anonymous World. Hope you are doing well. So in this video, we'll solve another general skill challenge called collaborative development. Skills are again general uh, tags are again general skills get. My team has been working very hard on new features for our flag printing program. I wonder how they will work together. Okay. Let's copy this link. Okay, so I will download the zip file here. Okay, let's unzip this. Uh, okay, so we have git file, then we have main, then feature, then feature part one, part two, part three, then we have flag.py. These look like some branches. Also, it was mentioned that a team was working, so it is possible that there are multiple branches, so different members working on different pages. It is a possibility. So let's go to our directory. Let's see what's inside flag.py. So it says print printing the flag. Okay, so nothing much. Let's see the ref log. Okay, we can see initial commit is init flag printer. Then they are moving from main branch to feature part one. Then they added part one, then they are, they move to part two, then 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 they move to part three. Okay, so there are three uh, branches feature part one feature part two and feature part three okay we can confirm that by using git branch yeah so so is the branches so our flag must be on in those branches like in three part so now there are two ways now either we can check all the commits uh, separately like git uh, by using git checkout and then that particular id okay and then there is one more way like merging those two main branch okay so for that we can use git merge then our branch name so first name is feature part one let's see if this works yeah updating fast forward flag.py one file changed now let's try reading that flag.py again so you can see one more line has been added print pico ctf teamwork okay now let's try to add the second branch okay again it's trying to reconnect okay wait a moment okay so again we will go back to our drop in let's see if it's still there yeah now we need to merge the second branch so we can use git merge feature part 2 okay it gives an error please tell me who you are run git config global user dot email okay so we need to uh, set our username and email for further merging so we can do that git config global then username uh, okay then we need to give user dot email. Let's give it random at the rate gmail.com. Yeah, let's try adding that merging that again. Yeah, auto merging flag.py conflict. Okay, so there is one conflict there and it says automatic merge failed. So if you will read the flag.py again, you can still see here that it has been uh, added there but it is not uh, merged yet so for that you can use git add and then file name which is flag.py okay and then you need to commit it so let's give a message merged now we can read the flag.py again so you can see it's here so this is our flag pico ctf then this is part 2 and now we need to merge the part 3 so we will use git merge feature part 3 okay again automatic merge failed so we need to resolve this conflict we will use the same method okay now let's read 
our flag yeah so this is our flag in three parts let's see if this works okay and then the last part Okay, so that's it for this video. I will see you in another video with another challenge.